What do you think about this? Liz, what? I said my family and I are going out for dinner, oh. not club. Yeah, so that doesn't work. Okay. Mm. Ma, but this will work then. Right? Yuck! I hate that dress. Nah, no, not that one. Okay, ma. Uh, but Liz, please help me look for my ruffle pink gloves. Ruffle pink gloves. Yes, yeah, right there in my handbag. Okay. What's that? Well, I, I think it's the ring. So, has my wife finally found the perfect dress? Oh, oh yes, 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 honey. This one. Yeah. Mama, I thought she uh, said it. Please. No, yeah, I love this one. Why aren't you doing something in the kitchen? Yes. Yeah, sir. yes, go and continue. Okay. Yeah, go. So that's the now that we are done with yours. Let me go check on the keys as well. Oh, good idea, honey. Yeah. Um, time is of the essence. Mm? Yeah. We don't have the luxury of time. I'm going to be back very okay. soon. So please hurry up because I know you. Mm? I know you. I'll be back shortly. Okay, honey. So please yeah. hurry up. Then. I'll be up right. by when you get yeah. back. Okay. husband almost saw that ring girl i was trembling <laughs> i was so scared i had to activate my senses my smartness you know? smart girl i had to maneuver things i had to get creative and smart <laughs> on the spot can you imagine <laughs> mm -hmm. but what do you think he would do would he get angry if he sees the ring uh, I mean, you'll just be asking plenty questions. Questions that I'm not ready to answer right now. You're never ready to answer any question. Why don't you get rid of the ring, babes? Get rid of it. Oh, Lizzie. I have to. I Thank you, Thank Liz. You. Thanks. I know your ex-boyfriend gave me... Hello, hello, hello. Ex-fiance. <laughs> yes, stop trying to downplay this thing. We weren't boyfriends and girlfriends. Mm. He gave me a ring before his death. He is my fiance. Ex-fiance. You've already moved on with another man. Holding on to that ring is going to remind you the past. Girl... Oh yeah, might have been dead. But my feelings for him are still as strong as ever. And that ring is the only thing I have left of him. So you understand why I would want to hold on to that, right? I understand. But you're married. Holding on to that ring only shows that you're clinging to the past. Can you not clinging to anything? Oh, well, you may be dead. But... I can't forget him. I'm not ready to forget him. Look, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying I don't love my husband, right? I love my husband very much. But Uyu was my first love. My first love. He meant the world to me. <laughs> Babe. I just hope that... This so-called ring from your ex-boyfriend does not get you in trouble with your husband. To be honest, because he might feel that you don't love him as much as you loved your ex-boyfriend. 
And that's the worst feeling for any man. Just get rid of this ring. Well, that's why he's not going to find out. Oh, really? Yes. He won't. Smart girl. Won't. I wish you good luck with that. And just be careful. If Kasara boss, I'm on <coughs> How's your night? Did you sleep well? Oh, I see you guys are set for school. Okay, having breakfast? Yeah. Great, great, great. Where's Liz? 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 Yes, ma. Good morning, ma. Uh, good morning. So I've instructed the driver to take you with the kids to school. Okay. Please make sure they're in their various classrooms before you start heading back home. Okay, ma. Okay? And make sure they are early. All right, ma. Did my husband eat before going to work? No, ma. He couldn't wait. Did you pack it up for him? Not really, ma. He was really in a hurry. I'm so sorry, ma. It won't happen again. It's okay. Um. Hey, girls. Mommy has a busy day today, but I'll be back soon. Okay? So be good children. Stay focused in school. And remember to be kind to everyone, okay? okay. All right. Bye, my love. Bye. See you. See you. Love you. Okay. Clara yeah. is a beautiful sister. How are you, my baby? We're doing great. How are you doing? How are you guys? Good evening, Donald. Liz, what's up now? I'm good. High school. <sighs> School's fine, you know. Oh, good Billy, Donald. Yeah, okay. the teddy bear you promised to buy for me. Uh-uh, princess. I've not even rested for a minute yet. Don't worry. I'm going to get it for you, yeah? I hope you got mine as well. I say, don't worry. Once I'm done, we'll talk about that. Lizzie, Afa. Yeah. Food house, I won't chop. Mm, there's nothing in the house now, but I'm going to prepare something as soon as I'm done with their homework. Ah. So there's nothing in the fridge that I can microwave and eat. Mm, I think there I think there's two. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm gonna sort myself out here. Okay, you can just go ahead and sort oh, yourself gosh. out. Okay, so why did you write Clara Was that what I asked you to write? No, I wanted to write. You yeah. wanted to write what? Okay. I'll write it. Clara. School is fine, just too much expenses and all. Nobody asked you about expenses. It's just an harmless answer, sis. It didn't seem like it. Honey, please, cut your younger brother some slack. Let him breathe. No, I know where this is leading. And I'm not ready to sit here and listen to all that. Sis, I did not come here for money. I told you, I, I only told you that I missed everybody. That's why I came. I, I'm a big boy now. Stop that greedy me. Of course. <laughs> oh, okay. So you're saying you won't ask for a penny when you're going back to school? Exactly. <laughs> so what here are you now, Donald? I'm in my final, sir. Wow, that's great. You're done already. Yes, sir. Okay, uh, you know what? Don't worry. Once you're done with school, we can work on securing a nice job for you. Oh, thank you very much, sir. I appreciate it. You're always welcome. Okay. Well, I see this evening is all about Donald. No one has even bothered to check how my day was. <laughs> Come on. Aren't you too old for sibling jealousy? Of course not. Too old. <laughs> you see, look at your elder sister. You see the way she's acting. Eh? Sis! Sis! Oh. 
Uh -huh. Good morning, sis. Good morning, Donald. Look at the way you're looking beautiful this morning. Ah. What do you want? I'm going back to school today, so I guess you let me inform you about that. Okay, great. Johnny Morris is back to school. I'm so sweet now, and I need money. Oh, so finally you've decided to say the main reason you came visiting. Huh? Donald, when would you stop extorting money from me in the name of school? Do I look like an ATM? No, sis, you know. If I do not ask you, who will I ask? Mm. You're the only one I have. Eh, sis, don't worry, I'm already in my finals, eh? Once I'm done, I'll get a nice job. And I will, I will spoil you. You <laughs> say, no, no. I will spoil you, please, no. Eh, sis, please. See your oh, mouth. Please, no, sis. So you've settled for whining me? No, no, sis. You know you're the, one I, you are the only one I love. Please, just do this for me now, please. Please. Fine! I'll send you some money. Mm. <laughs> also, send your account to my husband. I think he has something for you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. That's why I love you. I'll never trade you for anything. Yes. <laughs> I love, I you, love you too. Thank you so much. Okay, send yeah. me your account and save Johnny to school. Thank you. Okay? Thank you. And brother. please, stay focused. Okay, okay. Thank you so much. <sighs> Morning, sunshine. <laughs> How long have you been watching me sleep? Doesn't matter. The good thing is that oh. I have fed my eyes enough with your beauty. Oh. You're so sweet, honey. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I love watching you drool as well. Hmm? <laughs> what? Which of these shirts do you think I can wear to work today? Today? Yes. Honey, today is Saturday. I know. I have a meeting with the board of directors. And it had to be on a Saturday. Today? <sighs> Honey, that's not fair. Like, we made plans for today. And don't forget you promised to take the children out for shopping today. I know, my love. You see, this meeting is very important. Oh. And it's not something we can reschedule. Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Don't wear that one. I prefer that one. Oh. Mm. Okay. Thank you, my queen. I can't believe I cancelled my whole Saturday plans just so that my husband can cancel on me at the end. <sighs> Honey, come, 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 come. You can still hang out with Sage or better still take the kids shopping. I just want you to have fun. I don't want my absence to dull you, okay? You know I love you. Come on. <laughs> yeah, huh? So, time to hit the shower. Oh, huh? yeah. Um, please, tell me to help me. I, I okay, I will. <sighs> I 
I need to work, I need to get something doing. I need to get something doing, that's what I'm saying. Bro, I've been back for how long? I need to find something to do. I need to find something to do. I can't continue like this. I can't. Bro, it's not easy, man. I'm just, I just, I just, they, they roast. You gotta Stop, find excuse me. You gotta excuse find me, I'm about to drive out. Oi. Sanura. Oi. Is that you? It's me. It's in the flesh. Oh my god. Oi, you're alive. I'm alive. Where have you been? What happened? It's a long story. It's a very long story. Mom, please don't even give me the popcorn. Uh, you know what? Just go in. Uh, go in. Shut your popcorn, okay? Mommy's coming soon. Mom? Yeah, shut, shut the door. Shut the door. I'm coming. You're married? Yes, I'm married. Those are my kids. Oh, my God. Whoa. What happened? I want to tell you all about it, but I, I can't tell you here, right? Okay. <laughs> can I can I just take your number? Oh God. Sandra. Yes, my God. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh, guys, I'm so sorry. I was late. Sorry. Day at work today. When my boss was treating me, it was as if I stole his girlfriend or something. Man, I don't, I don't understand that man. I really don't understand him. Wait, I'm talking to you now. I'm talking to something wrong. Are you good? I saw her today. Sanura. <laughs> Wait. We're talking about your fiance, yeah. That you've been looking all over the place for. You can stop calling her my fiance now because she's married with kids. No. No way. And uh, what did you do when you saw her? What was I supposed to do? I was literally just there. I couldn't breathe. I was just looking. I was staring. How? Married with kids? No, bro. I can't really blame her. Ten years. That's a long time. 
What are you expecting? Hey guys! Hi, Jasmine. Hi, Jasmine. What are you doing? What's up? I'm good, man. Me, what's up? What happened? See, I don't know. I had a long day at work, and you guys should just talk about it. Me? I have a bunch of my What happened? Mm. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. You sure? Mm. Okay. How's your day? Mm. You look fine. I don't want you to leave me. I don't want to leave you as well, but then I have to go. Like, I'm trying to get a better life for us. Aren't you tired of this hard life that we are living? What I'm doing is not just for me, it's for both of us. This is me trying to get a good life for us. Why do you have to go so soon? Because it's the right time to go. Many people have gone already. I'm just the only one remaining. All my guys have gone. It's just me. I, look, I don't want to leave your side as well. But I have to go. I got to go hustle for us. Yes, but babe, I, I, traveling by road is not safe. <laughs> Who told you it's not safe? All my guys went by road. And they're already in their dream countries. They, they, I've been talking to them on the phone. Everything is fine. Look, it's not as dangerous as you think it is. It is cheap. It is safe. <sighs> Don't worry. I'm going to be fine. And see, listen, when mm. I get there, I'm going to write you every day. I'm going to talk to you all the time. Um, I'm going to miss you. You know, you've been the one since my day one. Look, I love you so much. Like, you even got me money to go on the street. I don't know what I'm going to do without you. You're my support system. I'm going to say something now. I don't mean to spook you, but... What? Sonora. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's going to happen in the future. Mm -hmm. What I'm certain of is that I'm always going to love you. Right? I'll always be there for you. I'm never going to forget about you. I want you to make me the same promise. Huh? I love you. You know I'm going to wait for you. This is not the most ideal way to make a proposal, but I'm going to do it. Propose. So now, if you truly are going to wait for me, mm -hmm. I want to give you this ring because I want to marry you. I want you to say yes. Babe, I promise you, I cross my heart, I'll wait for you. Will you marry me? <laughs> yes? Yes. Okay. Yes. Fits perfectly. Babe. Babe. Thank you for doing the right thing. Thank you for, like, this is so reassuring. Thank you for making this commitment. I'll be on this side waiting for you. I'll come back for you. I will. I'm gonna come back for you. Okay? Okay. <laughs> I love you. I love you more. I'm just so worried. I'm so worried about Uye. I haven't seen 
or heard anything from him since he traveled. Not even a phone call. No one has heard anything from him. I can't help but worry. Babe, <laughs> come to think of it, I've never heard anyone travel to abroad by road. Are you sure this is even legit? He said he has friends who have traveled by road <laughs> to the same destination and they are doing well. And you even allowed him to propose to you, tie you down, and won't go to abroad. Omo, um, I don't know for you, you allowed a man to cage you down. Better live your life. Live your life. I Go know my man. man. I know Uyi. Okay. Uyi is coming back for me. Okay. That was why he gave me this ring. No problem. Wait for him. Okay? Oh, I'll wait for him. I no know problem. he's waiting for me. Oh, I've said my part. Okay. I, I'm just worried. I haven't heard anything from him. Like, I can't help but worry about Okay. Him. No problem. Wait for him. Oh. Honey, what's happening? Nothing. So you decided not to watch TV with us? <clears throat> no. Why are you late by this time? It's still early. Are you alright? Uh, yeah. I'm fine, just tired. Okay. Yeah. Hope you had fun with the kids. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we did. That's cool. Did. Come on, dinner is ready. Mm? Um, honey, I'm not hungry. You guys can go on without me. What? What is it, honey? I'm okay, I'm just tired. Okay, if you say so, I think I'll join you. What are you doing? <coughs> Why aren't you going down to have dinner? If you're not having dinner, then I'm not having dinner either. <laughs> Honey, why do you have to be so dramatic? <laughs> Isn't that what you love about me? <sighs> okay, fine. Let's go have dinner. And that is what I love about you. <laughs> <laughs> so, <clears throat> after you. Uh -huh. After you, after you, after you, shall we? Thank you. <laughs> There's a car. <laughs> that reminds me, babe. Yeah. One of my colleagues sent me a vacancy. Oh. Yeah, I'll forward it to you so you can apply for it. It's your specialty, web developer. It's for one of those organizations, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, is these people, they'll pay me one cheap salary now. How much would they possibly pay me? Peanuts. I guess it, babe. Thing. But you have to work for a few months to enable you raise the capital you need. You don't understand. Look, I have tons of ideas in my head. Why do I want to go and collect peanuts from one cheap organization? If I had a laptop now, I would just be a freelance developer to so many companies. So why do that? Okay. Why, 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 when I can do that, why do I want to stick to one organization? Do you get? I love the idea. Yeah. I love, okay. How about we do like this? You sort out for gigs and I will save up some money to get you a good laptop. <laughs> but are you serious? I'm <laughs> serious, babe. I will. Just sort out for gigs. I'll, I'll get you a laptop. I'm not joking. You I will. will. Yeah. You I mean, will. anything to enable you earn cash. I really need you to move out from this apartment this so slowdown. we can spend more time Let's together. Slow down. We don't need to rush. Josh is not complaining. <laughs> he might not be complaining to you, but I know deep down he feels like we're inconveniencing him. Leave Josh. Leave Josh. Of course I will. Thank you. It's not a big deal. I love you, Oye. I can't do anything for you. I love you more. Come here. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank Welcome. You. <laughs> when did you get the laptop? I 
can't believe this. Was it not a few days ago that we talked about this guy? <laughs> and meanwhile, I thought you said he was dead. Sage, we and I disconnected ever since he traveled. No one heard anything from him, not even his parents. Then later on, we heard that everyone who had embarked on that journey had died at sea and their bodies lost forever in the ocean. I don't know. <laughs> this is serious. I've Girl. never heard this kind of story in my entire life. And did you guys care to talk? Did he tell you what happened to him all these years? Um, we never really got the chance to go down memory lane. But I gave him my card. Even though I doubt that he will call. Because, I mean, he saw my wedding ban and he saw the kids. I see. Mm -hmm. So what do you intend to do now? Girl, I don't know. I just feel so awful. Come on, babe. You don't have to feel that way. It's not your fault. To be honest, it's not. You don't have to feel bad. Girl, I wish he can understand it the way you're saying it. See, I'm sure he would call. Come to think of it, you both own each other an explanation. Just relax, you don't have to feel bad. None of this is your fault, trust me. Babe. Yeah. I need to get going. Lately, my husband has not been in a good mood. I don't know what the problem is. So, yeah. Really? What happened? I don't know. He just started acting up, maybe because of the baby thing and the rest and the rest. Oh, come on now. Peter should calm down now. He should understand that God is the one that gives children. How is it your fault? He doesn't feel that way. He thinks it's my fault. And I'm afraid he may want to take another wife. God forbid. He can't try that. You're not going to let that happen. I mean, the doctor said both of you are fine. I think you guys just have to patiently wait for God's time. Babes, there is nothing I can do. I can only try my best. Come here. I know. Don't worry. It would happen. When? Girl, just trust and believe it would happen. This is, yeah, this is quite slow. Yeah. Wait, do you have to tap on every dark yeah. box? Oh, you almost keep on box. <laughs> Wait, okay. Yeah, only 15 minutes. Wow. Oh, okay, look at that. Yeah, that's, that's a good score. That's a, that's a good score. And I love the melody. Salua, it's me. Um, hey, 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 Uye, how are you? Not great, not great. Um, can we meet? We need to talk, please. I think whatever we need to talk about can be discussed over the phone. Why, why, why can't we meet? You know that we have to. Wait, 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 wait Salua. I can't stop thinking about you. You can't shut me on like this. You can't. 
Are you not keen to know what exactly happened to me? Thank you again for agreeing to see me. It's okay. You're good. Thank you. So what happened to you all these years? It's a long story. It's a very long story. The journey wasn't what I thought it was going to be. It was scary and deadly. As we got on the first boat, they kept on transferring us to the next boat, to the next boat, to the next boat. And that went on for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks. At some point, we didn't have any food to eat anymore. No water to drink, nothing. People started dying from starvation. Some were drowning. We went on like that till I think we got to, I think it was Libya. We got arrested by the police. Said we didn't have papers or something. They took us on the ground prison. I lost my phone. I lost everything that I came with. I lost it all. I was there for the longest time. Wow. You really went through a lot. I did. Oh yeah, I'm so sorry to hear that. So how did you escape out of prison? I got out after 10 years. Wow. It was a miracle. It was nothing short of a miracle because all the time I was in prison, I kept on thinking about you. And I believe that God heard my prayer. Because how I was released, I, I don't know till today. People died in prison. People, people were raped. All sorts of things were happening there. But I got out and I came back to Nigeria. I started looking for you. The shock I got, the first shock I got was my dad was dead. So my mom said that he 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 had a heart attack because he couldn't hold the pain anymore. They all thought I was dead or something. But I found you. Coincidentally or not, but then I found you that day. And so now I still love you so much. Wow. I'm really sorry about everything that has happened to you, Oye. I'm just happy that we're here now. Yeah. I'm glad you're alive. You made it. I love you. Still. Oye. I still love you. But well, there's nothing we can do as it stands. So no, no. Oye, you have to move on. Right. Because you've already moved on, right? I waited for you. I did. I know you did. It's not your fault. I'm really sorry about everything you went through. And I wish you all the best life has got to offer. I wish that you find peace and love because you deserve it.
Goodbye, Oi. This way ends. Food out of you. We. Yeah, go chop no more. I'm not hungry. What do you mean I'm not hungry now? And eh, what do you mean? After all the effort I put into it, you didn't eat yesterday. You're not eating today. I tell me I'm not hungry. Now like, come downstairs. It's fine. I'm, I'm okay. You're not okay. You're not. Guy, <sighs> you need to move on. You need to lighten up. Oh yeah, I'm talking to you now. Baba, free me now. Ah, free me. I said I'm not eating. Is it by force? Ah, okay, no, I'm bro. fine. I'm fine. Bro, can't we beg him to eat now? Ah, ah. See, when you're hungry, you know where the food is. You come and eat. No problem. We beg you to beg me. Honestly, babe, I feel for that guy. His story is really touching. I know, right? But it's a good thing you gave him a chance to explain himself. Girl, our discussion almost gave me a heart attack. I can imagine. I felt so bad for him the whole time. Mm. So what <sighs> happens now? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? What was the conclusion between both of you? <sighs> I mean, I told him, let's leave the past where it is, okay? Mm -hmm. And move on. I mean, we've moved on now. Oh, really? Did you agree to that? Did you have a choice? <sighs> but... You guys are cool like friends. Friends. Why not? Girl, we can't be close for any reason. Why not? It would just be awkward now. Come on, babe. Just say you still love him. Anyway, let me ask it. Do you still love him? Mm hmm Please. Let's forget about we. Mm. Uh, mm. I'm just glad that he's alive mm. and well. Mm. Uh, let's leave things the way it is. Please, I beg. So, no, what about I his ring? When are you returning it? Yes? Girl, tell me what you think. What do you mean, what do I think? You should return the ring. If you want to move on, you have to return his ring. Because if you do not, it seems like you are clinging to the past. Which is not good for your marriage. Yes, so you have to return the ring. Okay, I'll find a way to send it across to him. Whatever, if you say so. Just be careful and do the right thing, babes. Yeah. 
I'll stay true to myself. You should. Mm. Thank you so much, Sage. You're welcome. What a friends for? <laughs> All the inconveniences. I'm always here for, I'm always here for it. <laughs> always here. Thank you. I appreciate mm. you. But for now, mm. I should get going. Don't mm. forget, I'm also married. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Babes, it's fine. It's nothing. I'm here for you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> You've tried. <laughs> yeah, I know. Okay, I'll see you today. Thank you, James. Mm. Oh, thank you. Thank you, you for coming. Always. So, mm. when am I seeing you again? Uh, I have to work tomorrow. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Take care. Bye. All right, my regards to Peter. All right, sure. Okay. Bye. <laughs> task your home task yep. okay are you supposed to be doing that yourself where's liz she's in the kitchen making dinner okay let me see it let me see let me see what y'all do what subject is this it's english studies okay where's your communication book where's not your communication book Mom, huh? who's calling you? Is it dad? Uh, no, it's not daddy. It's um, it's my business partner. What okay. stuff? So, we don't understand this word. This word. Vividly. Yeah. You don't know the meaning of vividly? I think maybe I forgot to. Okay. Vividly means clear, you know, to Okay, yeah, so vividly means to seventy percent loading. It's done. You can check your email, sir. You're welcome. Liz? Liz? Yes, ma. I'm coming now. Ma. Uh -huh. Liz, is breakfast ready? Yes, ma. Okay, great. So help me check on the children. Let them know that breakfast is ready. Okay. Tell them I'll join them shortly. Okay. Okay, ma. Thank you. Hi, Oye. Sonora, why are you doing this to me? Hmm? I've been trying to reach you for days now and you're not taking my calls. It's killing me. Oye, we have nothing to talk about. That's not true. Aside from being my fiancé, you are also my best friend. I can't lose that too. 
Oye, we can't be best friends. I am a married woman with children. Do you want me to start acting sneaky around my husband in my home? Oye, please, you need to stop this. Oh, so you intend to eradicate me from your life? Is that what this is? Oh, you please stop this. Honestly, I wish I can. But I've tried. It's not working. I really, really want to see you again. Please. Oh, you, we can't meet again. Sanura, please. Oh, you. Please. I'm begging you. Forget about me. I can't. I still love you. It's not like that. I just needed a break. You needed a break from me? No, I don't mean it like that. Then how is it then? You've not called or texted me in weeks. And for the time I tried reaching out, you've been ignoring me. Jasmine, please. Please what? I need an explanation, Uyu. What's going on? Oh. Okay, if you must, if you must hear. I've not been feeling well. I've been sick. You've been sick and you didn't tell me? Because I didn't want to trouble you. I didn't want to trouble you with my problems. Must I do that all the time? You've never acted this way before. I told you to promise to tell each other everything. And I'm saying I don't want to trouble you. Must I put my problems on your head all the I'm time? I'm not complaining, am I? I'm sorry to complain. You'd have told me you were sick instead of ignoring me. I felt bad. A lot was going through my mind. Okay, Jasmine, I am sorry. It's okay. Have you taken medications? I have. Are you sure? Yes, I'm better. <sighs> My love, I didn't mean to yell. I just felt bad that you would go weeks without talking to me. I understand. It's your emotions, I get it. Promise me that won't happen again. I promise. Are you sure? I'm sure. Guess what? Mm -mm, mm -mm. I, I, I can't guess. I don't know how to guess. I said guess. I don't guess. Oh my god, know. you're so boring. Yes, I know. Anyways, I got you a laptop. Wait, what? Yes. You got me the laptop? Yeah. <laughs> you got me the laptop? Yeah, baby. You did? Yes, yeah, you did. It? It? <laughs> yeah, I did. Just as we discussed. Oh my god. Okay. And this is the charger. It's a dog. Yeah. Let's check it out. Did you, did, you, did you buy internet? Do you have internet that we can use? This guy! Oh, come on with me again, Abby. Bro, that was a flex, this laptop. I see him now. Baba, <laughs> it makes sense, man. Makes sense. I still feel say the price where she get them for fairly used too much now. I see. No, come on, see dollar now. Everything has gone up now. Gadgets are expensive now. Oh, that's true. Yeah, that's true. But guys, this is Jasmine, babe. She's she's really taking care of you now. Yeah, and I'm going yeah. to pop the question. What question? When are you going to propose to her, bro? Come on, keep up. Sometimes the way you talk, I'm just wondering. I should propose to her. Then I get married to her and bring her to this house. Or what? Do I have a house? Do I have anything? I just got a job. Guy, the reason before you talk now. So if I marry now, okay, she'll be here. I'll be in the middle, then you'll be here. Okay. I don't hear your side. But it's like, is that the only reason? Which other reason would there be? Wait, I want to be that now. Someone, don't watch Netflix now. Hey, guy. Yeah. I get oh. hey, I have clients I have to give job to. Just don't disturb me. You just call a laptop. How many clients? 
What do you watch Netflix? Wait, no way. I'm, I'm going go, 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 go. <laughs> I'm a serious guy. I have plenty of things to do. When I say you watch bad things for there. <coughs> Dead guy, you don't know anything. Hey, half an hour, how you doing? Thanks, sir. Who is the fan? Your boss. I'm mm -hmm. not no, there around here. You just go work now, nah, now, nah, now. Nah. You don't see I'm a city call. Yeah. Nah. I must have missed him. Now, now, nah, nah, just come out. Okay, okay. I'll just see his wife then. Okay. I have a package to give them. Uh, give me the package and I'll make a make a No, no, oh, no, it's personal. I have to give it to them myself. They don't, they don't let me say they come. No, don't, no don't worry, don't worry. It's personal. I have to give it to them. It's important, too. Hey, hey, see, calm down, Look, I know the family. They're my friend. I need to. It's personal packing that is important. I have to give it to them. I have to. Will you calm down? I said I have to give it to them. Oui. What are you doing here? I, I came to give you the package. The package. Okay, you, you can go. I'll take it up from here. Okay, right, sure. What are you doing showing up your face here at my house? You're driving me crazy. You're not picking my calls. Did you block me? You blocked my number. What are you doing here? I have to, we have to be sure. We can't sweep things under the carpet now. But you have to show your face here. I made sure that your husband left before I came in. I was checking. Why are you doing this to me? Because I need to see you. Don't you? Please, you have to go now. Wait, wait, before you tell me to go. Can we at least meet? And talk? Please. Talk about what? About us. Us. There's nothing to talk about. Please. Please, please, let's talk. Is that a deal? At least let's meet and talk, please. Will you please just go? Okay, at least tell me, is it a deal? We meet and talk? Fine. Go. Okay, one more thing. Unblock my number. Will you just go, please? Oh, oh, oh. take this service guy, we believe. Okay, so useless. Call this go. <sighs> Babe, your phone has been ringing. Pick up the call. Honey, it's a private number. You know I don't answer private calls. Okay. Oh, honey, for the person to keep calling, then it must be an emergency or something. If it's that important, they can leave a text message. Okay, then, if you say Dad, so. Mom. Yes, we have. Mom, let me watch my favorite show. Please, could I just watch it here? No. It's a weekday. You have to be in school early tomorrow. Look, your mom and I will consider. But it's just for an hour, okay? Thank you, Dad. Yes. <laughs> you know, I'm the best dad in the whole world. Yes, come, dad. come, 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 come. Yes, that's my girl. Mm? So don't worry. Eh? Go. Mm? Or oh, sit rather. Right There's point in this girl. Honey, please. Just let her be. Mm? Yeah, please. Uh. 
I'm even done with the, with, with the boring match. Oh, what is it? Why do you keep using different lines to call me? I told you I'll think about it. Fine. I've heard you. I'll let you know. Good night. So this is where you live? Yeah. I stay here with my, my friend. But he's not home at the moment. Oh, okay. Um, do I get you a glass of wine, juice? Oh, I'm fine, thank you. Yeah. Not even a glass of water? I'm good. Um, Sandra, I know it feels like I'm pushing, but I still love you. Yes. And um, I can't turn up the feelings the way you want me to do it. I, I can't. What do you want? I just want to know if you feel the same way. What? The other day at the supermarket, I saw the way you looked at me. It, it, it tells me something. It tells me that you probably still love me and you just don't want to admit it. The ring I gave you, do you still have it? Do you still have the ring I gave you? What does it matter if these feelings are there or not? The point we is... We can't do anything about it. The point is, the point is, we can still be happy together. Yes. What do you mean? Your husband doesn't make you happy. Doesn't make you happy the way we were happy together. Hmm? Tell me. My husband and children make me happy. Do you love him? Sanara, do you love him? Do you love him? If you, if you tell me now that you love him, I'll stop. Do you love him? Do you love him? Oui. Do you love him? Stop. Tell me, tell me you don't feel the same way. Tell me. No, tell me you don't feel the same way. Sanara, if you tell me you don't feel the same way now, I'll stop. Yeah, you are. Thank you, babes. Thank you for dropping me off. You pay me off. <laughs> Next time, you pay me off. All this free driver work I'm doing for you. <laughs> how, how much do you want? Five million. Small change. Uh, cash, my dog. I'll, do <laughs> I'll see you next week. Yeah? Okay, All thank right. you. Oh. Um, babe, wait. Please. Is everything okay? <sighs> so I went to see Oye two days ago at his place. Are you serious? I kid you not. Babes, huh? I thought you said you guys were done and dusted. I thought so too. Girl, I couldn't help it. He kept calling and texting. I just had to go see him at his place. So what did you guys talk about? I mean, it was just confessions and confessions. Babes, I think we're still in love with each other. Sandra, you can't do that. You can't do that. You have to stop seeing that guy. You really need to stop. We kissed and... Babes. You kissed him? What is wrong with you, guy? What is your problem? I couldn't help myself. I couldn't help myself. Okay? 
I could don't forget that Uye and I were engaged to get married before he disappeared. So don't act like this is easy for me. It's not easy for me. Can you just listen to yourself? But wait, wait, wait. After kissing, what happened? Don't tell me you made out with that guy. I mean, if you're asking if we had sex, yeah. no, we didn't. Are you sure? Yeah, we didn't. We didn't. We didn't have sex. <gasps> Babes, this is not good. You need to stop seeing this guy. You need to cut all ties with him. You are married. Please try and fix this while you can. You think I haven't tried? You think I haven't tried? Well, try harder. See, babe, you need to try harder. You need to fight this, but this fight yourself. Because the way things are going, you might end up cheating on your husband. And I don't know how this is going to end. Fix this. Stop seeing this guy. I've heard you. I'll, I'll keep trying. Sanura, keep trying. Try harder. Thanks for your advice. See, babes, you don't have to thank me. Do the right thing. Do the right thing. Don't put your marriage at risk. I'll call you next weekend. Okay. Get your I'll husband you. for me. Thank you. Thank you for dropping me, babes. Keep mentioning. Please. Get your husband for me. Take care of yourself. Yeah, yeah. I'll see you soon. Bye. Okay, bye. Your son, right? Yeah. Wow. He was the judge. Cutie. I must say, I've heard a lot about you. <laughs> and um, now I know why. <laughs> nice <laughs> to meet you. Nice to Please sit. Oh, thank I you. Thought you were going to Just, just now, you can stand. <laughs> nice to meet you, too, Josh. Yeah. How are you doing? How are the kids and uh, uh, the family? No, see, she, she brought a lot of things for us. Ah, no, you should help me to this. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's so sweet. Okay. So, you guys enjoy yourself. Go. He talks too much. No, he seems a nice guy. Yeah, but he talks too much. You good? You alright? <laughs> yeah, fine. Yeah, you want me to get you something? Mm -hmm. I'm okay. You know, all the while I was in prison, mm -hmm. I never stopped thinking about you. I kept on praying and promising myself that if I ever get to see you again, mm -hmm. I'm never going to lose you. I also prayed and waited for you. I know it took years. But look at us now. We're so perfect together. <laughs> who's that? Oh! Who's it? Who's it? Who's it? My husband. Don't pick it. Don't pick it. I know, but please, I... Please, please don't pick it. Don't let's ruin our moment. This is our moment. Okay? This is us. Let's cherish this moment. For the first time in a long time. You're in my arms again. Let's cherish this. Hmm?
Darling, what happened? I was worried sick. I know. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't even know what was going on on the road today. I think it had to be an accident or something. The traffic was massive. I was like, where did all this come from? Traffic? Yeah. Was that why you didn't pick my call? Oh, honey, you called me. Yes, you did. Fine. Oh, honey, I'm sorry. It might have been when I was in that meeting earlier. Honey, I had to put my phone on silent mode and I forgot to turn it back on. I'm sorry. Honey, I don't really like this. You almost give me a heart attack. Not bad. I'm sorry, my love. The kids were really waiting up on you. You see, oh. you would have called when you knew you'd be home later than usual. Hmm? Yeah. Like I said, I'm I'm sorry, honey. I didn't Okay, okay, okay. So how are you feeling? How was your day? <sighs> Fine, but exhausted. Oh. Mm. <laughs> okay, um why don't you go upstairs mm. and freshen up while I microwave something for us to eat. To eat? Yeah. You haven't had dinner? No. I was too worried to eat. Honey, <laughs> come here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my love. Don't worry. Yeah, I'll be out in the jiffy. Yeah, when I go to the kitchen, I'll be something for us to eat. Oh my god. Yeah. <sighs> Um, Liz, what's for breakfast? Ma, I'll be making fried yam and egg sauce. You'll be making? Yes, ma. Does that mean you haven't started making it? Um, no, ma, but I'll make it really snappy. I was attending to the kids. Okay, please, make it snappy, yeah? Because I want my husband to have breakfast before he goes to work. Sure, ma. And he'll be coming out soon. Okay. Um, yeah. Oh, wait. Ma? Please, one more thing. I just want to appreciate you for all that you do for <sighs> us. Everything you do around here, we see it. I mean, I know we're paying you, but it's still not enough for all that you do around here. We appreciate you. Ma, it's nothing. You know, I really love children. And mm. trust me, Ella and Clara, they're my favorite. Thank you. I'm really happy to have you around, especially now that... Work has become even more tedious for me. It's fine, ma. The kids are really doing great. Oh, nice. Okay. Thank you, ma. Um, please, please. Ma? Feel free to let me know if you need anything. Ah, thank you, ma. Okay, all right. Okay, I'll be around soon. Okay, ma. Okay, sent you something. So I sent you the money. It's not too much. Please manage. I appreciate it. I do. Really? Yes, of course. Thank <laughs> you. I really want you to move out of this place and start something of your own. Like a good business. I know. I don't want you to keep living like this <laughs> trust me i don't want to live like this I, i'm tired of this i have so many lucrative ideas in my head but then i don't have the money to execute them so that's i'm stuck here i understand look i want to do more for you 
It's just that my husband and I share joint accounts, so I can't make any huge withdrawal without him noticing it. Oh, you guys do share joint accounts? Yeah. So, he knows how much I earn and how I spend my money. That's why I haven't been able to do bigger things for you. And I feel bad. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. You don't, need, don't need to feel bad. I mean, you're trying. You're doing what you can. Right? I'll just keep hustling. I mean. But you see, um, that's why I have started saving up some money in a new account. Yeah, oh, but okay. it's going to take time to grow. Yeah. Oh, that's serious. But trust me, when I'm able to save up something here, I would do big things for you. You know, we can take care of every dream and ambition that you want to pursue. Yeah. It's okay, it's fine. Um, I mean, for now, I'll just, I'll just keep hustling. Oui. Yeah. Come on, I'll see you. Hey, give me a minute. Let me just see. Papa, it's a full keep your phone. It's on silent. It's on silent. Wonderful. See, Jasmine's on her way here. On her way here? When? Like when? Which day? Tomorrow, sir. Jasmine's on my way here. See, I tried convincing her not to come here, but oh, no, nothing. I don't understand. She cannot be on her way here now. You know what's going on now. Oh, no concern me. Go call her. Go call her now. Nah. Okay, go call her. Ah, this guy, you don't be yourself, sir. I don't want her. Here you go. Ah, um. <clears throat> Is everything okay? Yeah, yeah, everything is fine. It's, it's just Josh. He's still feeling well, you know? Really? Yeah. I hope it's not that bad. We don't want it to get bad, so I need to go and get him drugs now, like like right now, so he doesn't get bad. Oh, okay, that's fine. I'll drop you off. I'm about to leave. You're such a lifesaver. <laughs> no, it's okay. Thank you. It's okay. Um, I'll help you with your bag. Oh, my bag. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Bro! Man! That was close. Close! Wait, 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 wait. How did you manage to convince Jasmine not to come to the house? Well, uh, sense no go kill me. Sense is too much for me. <laughs> You know what I had to do? I told Sandra that she was sick. You're very sick. She just, oh, how is here? That's how she followed me to go to the pharmacy to get you drugs. <laughs> so Jasmine's small thing. Are you serious? That's what I don't come again. Wait, but we we sick. No, no. I, I'm just saying that you were sick. Bro, don't involve me in all this your drama. I'm begging you. What's that supposed to mean now? Ah, you're the one that decided to be playing this dangerous game now. Bro, well, the thing is, you don't even know what's going on. You don't know. All right. I don't know. I don't even understand what's going on. You should explain it to me. All right. <clears throat> so, Sanura, uh -huh. my girl, I love her to bits. Wonderful. Jasmine, on the other hand, she's a good girl. No capping. I'm not going to lie. She's been good to me. That's it. So, the summary of what you are saying is I'm going to be best man for two different people. And Sanura is one of them that's already married. <laughs> you know I'm supposed to get married to Sanura, right? Sure. You know? Yeah. I understand. But what you're not understanding is Sanura is already married. I just don't forget Jasmine. If Jasmine finds out she's going to kill you, she's going to kill me. She killed everybody that knows about this. Calm down. Calm down. You know you have IBP. Calm down. It's okay. Don't worry. Let me tell you, I just need to put things in proper perspective. And I'll sort things out. Everything will be alright. Everything will be fine. I know what I'm doing. Okay, fine. You know what you are doing? 
I'm just begging you. I'm the only son of my parents. Eh? I don't want to die early. <laughs> Take it easy. Calm down. Everything's gonna be fine. Uh -uh. No problem. Bro, what did you cook? Did you cook something? Ah, this guy should you whiny. I know the one controlling two women. Let them come and cook for you now. Call one of them. If you don't have your number, you can take it here. Anyway, take your drug. Think I can go find something to eat. I'm sure you can start. Let me just try something. Yeah, we're actually both drugs. Why are you crazy? I've been wondering if you need the drug. Because now, person, we know where we're going to be seen, we know where we're control two women. Just this guy, my cook for him. You get Jasmine here, you get this one here. Don't turn me to housewife. Oh my, oh my god. Clara, wake up, it's bedtime. Ella. I hope that I'm coming. Welcome, sir. Welcome, sir. How was work today, sir? Very good. Why am I just not in bed yet? Oh, they insisted on waiting for their mom, but they slept off in the process. My wife is not home yet. Yes, sir, but she just called me that she's stuck in traffic. So I want to take them upstairs. Okay, please take them to bed. Okay, sir. Clara, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Bedtime. Up, 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 up. Take it easy. Up, up. Okay. Gently, don't want to fall. Just hold my hands. Thank you. Cool. Oh. I've been calling you. I've been calling you. You, you didn't see my call? No, I didn't until I got home like 20 minutes ago. Sorry about that. Okay, I just wanted to let you know what was going on on the road. The traffic was something else. Really? Yeah, so I was just calling you to let you know that I'll be home late. <sighs> yeah, I heard so from Liz. Hmm? Oh, okay. Yeah. So, okay. how is work? Mm, work was alright. And you? A bit stressful. <laughs> you know now, as usual. Oh, sorry, love. Thank you. So, I was thinking mm. that your work is becoming more tedious for you these days. Darling, you know, mama closing time was 5 p.m. And now you stay till 9 to 10 p.m. And it's really getting me worried. Why don't you just give it a break? Honey, no. No, it's not a problem at all. I can handle it. Samira, the reason I work so hard is just so you won't overwork yourself. I don't like you coming home late these days. It's not even good for the kids. Honey, look. I think you're thinking about things. Too much. <coughs> Just don't worry about it. I've got this. Sonora, the kids barely see you these days. Because you come only late when you're already asleep. And now you're starting working on Saturdays. When you're supposed to be with the kids, they need their mother. Honey, the kids are fine. They're doing just fine. And Liz have been taking good care of them. And you try to make it seem like I'm not there for my kids. That's what Sundays are for. I spend time with them on Sundays. You know me. I hate being idle. I love my job. I'm a productive person. I'm not saying you shouldn't be. I just want you to set some limit and create time to be with your family. That's all. <sighs> I've heard you. I've heard you. I'll do something about it. Okay. I promise I will. I need to go take a shower. Yes. 
Have yeah. a long day. Wow. And that is it. So we're done. So it's my turn, right? Yes, baby. Let's see what you have here. And Clara, you can go and play games with your iPad now, okay? Thanks. Clara, what is wrong with you? Are you okay? No, I'm not. I miss my mom so much. I haven't seen her all week and I don't like that. Oh, baby. I'm so sorry to hear that. You know, mommy has been so busy with work lately. I miss her too. Oh, and she misses you both too. Can't you assist her with some work so that she can have time for us? Oh, baby. It doesn't work that way, okay? But don't worry, girls. I'm going to try and convince mommy to take you both on a very nice time out when school vacates. Really? Yes, baby. That's going to be great. Mm -hmm. like you like it, right? Now smile for me. Are you happy now? So you can now go and play with your phone, right? Thank you. Okay, so let's get back to work. What have you been writing? I've been writing all the words of the book. You didn't write it well, yeah. How have you been? Now write. No. Right? I am a girl. Okay, write it. Babes, is everything okay with you? We don't talk like we used to talk on the phone. You don't come to my place. You don't text. Are we fighting or did I offend you? No. Of course not. Girl, honestly speaking, I have been pretty occupied with work. Samira. So work took all your time. You didn't remember to call. You didn't remember to text. You didn't remember to pass by. It's fine. I was worried, so I decided to come and check up on you. Oh. Thanks for caring. Girl, honestly speaking, it's been work. Okay. So how are your kids and the husband? Oh, great. They're fine. Okay. Yeah. Ray's taking a nap and the children are in the other room playing, I guess. Guess what? What? Guess. Come on. Don't get the vibe. Guess. Nah, I can't. Tell yeah. me. What? You're not always good with guessing. Guess, just try. Yeah, yeah, you already know. So tell me, what's up? I'm pregnant. <laughs> Wait! Are you serious? So a week in! Oh my god! You said it! Thank god! I'm so happy, babe. This is good news. I'm so happy. They wow. God did it. You <laughs> said be super excited. You can say that again. See, excited is understatement. Baby, this, baby, that, baby, this. Oh, Peter oh, has oh. been the most happiest person on earth now. I was so close to losing my marriage. And God Thank came through. Look at that. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Thank you. Oh, finally. Anyway, enough of me. So tell me, what has been going on with you aside from work, the family, the kids, me and your husband? Oh, great. How are you and Oi? Oi. Mm hmm. Girl, how? What about Oi? Me and Oi, we're not friends now. I don't have any contact whatsoever with Oi. Uh, girl, we love Oye. We need to celebrate this good news. Okay, if you yeah. say that. That's yeah. super good news. So, yeah. what do you have in mind? I don't have anything in mind. I don't have any like anywhere to go. I don't have anything in mind. Okay, so how about we go to your favorite spot? Perfect, because I'm starving. Like, I'm okay. starving. Great, then. I'm, I'll just go get ready. Be <laughs> fast, though. Five, five minutes. Five minutes. I'm so hungry. Five minutes. I'm waiting. Wow, I'm so boring that you have to leave me in the room and come and watch TV. No, no. My favorite show is showing. My favorite show is showing. Mm. Okay, then let's watch it together. What are you doing now? 
What do you mean by what am I gay? Why are you avoiding me? I said my favorite show is on now. That's Please! Watch. Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. You've been on this attitude for weeks now. Jasmine, what attitude are you talking about now? When last did you touch me? Jasmine, stop now. You know even me. You know I'm a machine, but there's a lot on my mind right now. Oh, please! Does that require you staying away from your girlfriend? I'm not staying away. What do you mean by I'm staying away? Please, please don't stop. You've been avoiding me. Did I do something wrong? You did. Let's not argue about this, please. I'm not here to argue with you. Don't you love me anymore? Which one is love? How do you love anyone we're seeing now? I'm, I'm, I'm just going through a lot. I'm not in the mood. You're going through a lot? Yes. You know what? I'm tired of you. Please. I'm going through a lot. I'm going through a lot. I'm going through a lot. That's what it means. Hold yourself or fix yourself. Checking time off. Oh. It's getting late. You don't want to get into traffic, babe. Don't worry. I'll be staying a few days here. Yeah. Um, babe, really? wake up. You're sleep talking. You're sleep talking. I said you are going to be I'm late. I'm away from work. Ah, babe, you can't. Babe, wake up. You can't. You, we can't do that. Oh, you. Where we just sleep? I don't understand. Why are you acting like it's the first time I'm spending the night here? What I'm, what I'm saying is that we can't be inconveniencing the guy. We can't be doing that. It's not fair. Is he complaining? I know what I'm saying. Gosh! What is it now, Uni? Are you trying to throw me out? Of course. That's not the point. That's you know what? I'm leave. I'm tired of your drama since you just don't want me here. No, it's not. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying that. So just want to move. Come on. Hey, 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 who is this woman? This is Samira, my girlfriend. <laughs> what? Yeah. You didn't have the guts to say it to my face. So this is the reason for your sudden change of attitude. You've been cheating on me with this whole thing. Hey, hey. Okay. This is getting too much. Who she? Hey, what's wrong with you? Who talks to her like that? Hey, you slapped me. After everything we've been through, after everything I've done for you. What did you really do for me? You know what? It's fine. No problem. School. So why didn't you tell me you had a girlfriend? <laughs> she, she no, come on, she's not my girlfriend. She's not. She's just some random, you know. Random. Yeah, like just random stuff. It's not nothing serious going on there. I can't take this. No, 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 be easy now. No, 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 don't do this now. She's just random. She's nobody. Okay. Samira, so, so she's nobody. No, oh, she's nobody. I'm, I'm not joking. Goodbye, please. No, now. Excuse me. Excuse me. Samira, please.
pick up now, pick up now. Hello? Why are you calling me, you idiot? Uh, babe, just calm down. Please just listen to me, okay? I'm sorry that I hate you. I'm sorry. But I needed to make my acting so believable. Acting? What are you talking about? That, that woman you see, she's rich. Oh, she's got money. She's got a lot of money. And I need to get money from her for our future, for you and I, so that we can have a future together. Oye, what rubbish are you saying? Haven't you hurt me enough? Do I look that stupid to you? Her name is Samura. Hmm? We were together before I had to travel. Um, so I came back. She's gotten married already. She's had two kids. She's been married for years. Do you really think that's the kind of woman I want to spend my life with? Come on. Wait, are you serious? Of course I'm serious. So what I'm trying to do is I just want to get money from her and then you and I would have a future together. Come on, you've been with me from how long now? You've been with me thick and thin. I just want money for us. That's what I'm trying to do. I just need you to please play along. Do you get? What exactly is your plan? Now you're talking. So here it is. Listen. So um, I'm sorry about Jasmine. The reason why I didn't send her away is because she, she's been good to me. I, I'm not going to lie. She's been that one good person that has helped me since I came to Lagos. I don't love her or anything. I don't. Clearly, it's you I love. But then, I've ended things with her. It's over. It's done. This is not about your girlfriend or your ex-girlfriend. This is about us. What are we doing? How long do you intend for us to continue like this? But I thought we talked about this. We've moved past this now. What are your plans? What, 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 what do you mean? What are your plans for us? How long do you want us to keep sleeping with each other in your friend's house? How long? Forever? Think about it! You're right, you're right. I get it. Um, let me tell you. The truth is, what matters to me is my happiness, your happiness, the fact that we're together again. Babe, you and I know that your husband can give you that. Look at us. We've waited for this our whole life. Now we're in each other's arms again. Do, do you think it was a coincidence that we just found each other just like that? It wasn't a coincidence. I know things might not be rosy now, but then just look at us. I love you, you love me. We make love together, we're good together. I can't stop thinking about you, you can't stop thinking about me. Everything is perfect and the future will lay itself out. We don't need to worry about the future. Let's live in the moment. That's what we used to do. That's what we're about. I love you. <laughs> I love you more. I love you, you Come here. You're my girl. drinking? I had a very interesting guest at the office today. Oh yeah? And I'm really trying so hard not to believe everything I was told. Even when my gut feeling says it's true because of the way you've been acting. I want to ask you this once and I need an honest answer. Sandra, who is we? What? Answer me! Is he the reason you've been lying to me? Coming up late and even ignoring our kids? Tell me the truth, Samura! Tell me the truth! Yes. Yes. 
Yes, who is my lover? It's a long story, Ray. Oya and I were supposed to get married many years ago, but we got separated. I thought he had died. Ray, that was way before I met you. Honestly speaking, I didn't I didn't mean for any of this to happen. How could you do this to me? How could you do this to us? What were you thinking getting back together with your ex-lover? When you knew we were married with kids? That's in your process at all! I love him. No, you don't. You don't love anyone but yourself! Everything you've ever done is for your selfish game. I can't even stand you right now. Because you disgust me. You know what? I regret the day I put a ring on that finger. What he hit you? Like, come on. I didn't take this guy for a woman, Peter. No, this guy's gonna hear from me. This guy is gonna hear from me. He will hear from me. No, what kind of nonsense? No, 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 no. Please, I beg you, don't do anything stupid. Please, I beg you. I don't want any confrontation between you and Ray. How did you even find out? Are you seriously asking me that? Of course, your crazy girlfriend, Jasmine. Oh, she's the one who did it. Yeah, I can tell you for a fact. She said it. She did it. So this is a way of getting back at me, huh? Come on, this is too cheesy. Babe, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to go through that. I'm really sorry. So what are we going to do now? I don't know. Ray hasn't said a word to me since yesterday. Are you afraid of what he might do? No. I'm just tired of leaving behind my shadow. Good. And make sure he doesn't hit you again. He won't. Look, baby, I'm not trying to tell you what to do, okay? But then, whatever you decide, I'm with you a hundred. A hundred percent. Okay? You need a massage. I should massage you, yeah? Huh? Where are you coming from at this time? I went to see Sage. You went to see Sage or your boyfriend? Which one is it? Look, I'm not in the mood for all of this. I just came to grab some stuff. Oh, really? So you can go back to the kids' room? Sabura, you have no shame. You couldn't even come to apologize to me for what you did. Which means you can't change. And don't intend to stop. We oh, yeah, and I were supposed to- Don't! Don't ever mention that name in this house again. I can't believe you're still seeing that guy after everything. I thought I married a good woman. But you're no different from all those prostitutes in the street. Well, maybe if you were man enough, I wouldn't go running back to the hands of my ex. <laughs> How dare you say that to me? How dare you? I was good to you. I didn't throw you out when I found out you're nothing but a cheat. Let and then you're saying I'm not man enough. You are nothing, but I am a grateful idiot. This is the way I'm 
Brush my teeth. Brush my teeth. Brush my teeth. Brush my teeth. Alright, take it up from here. Let me see you doing. Okay. <laughs> okay, so you guys should hurry up so we can go to bed, alright? Mom, mom, mm. are you sleeping with us tonight? Yes, darling. Again. Again? Why the long face? You're not happy spending more time with mommy? But dad will be alone and don't like that. Your dad will be fine, okay? Mom, he doesn't even come here to say goodnight anymore. Look, your dad is very busy with work, okay? He still loves and cares about you guys so much. He'll come around. Okay. Okay, so who's in the mood for some bedtime stories and lullaby? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Babe, I've been trying to hold myself back from saying this. I, I know it might not be my place to say it, but I feel like I should say it anyway. This guy, he's not going to stop beating you. You need to leave him. You need to divorce and leave this marriage. No! Oh, you know, why would you say that? I don't think that's a good idea. Do you want to wait till he kills you? Till he lays you, till he kills you? Is that what you want to wait for? He won't kill me, okay? He's the father of my children. How do I start explaining to my kids that mom and dad are getting a divorce? Or my parents? Just tell them he's a wife beater. Yes, and he beats you for a living. That's what you need to tell them. You need to leave this marriage. You know, the whole divorce process can be overwhelming. Visits to court. And, you know, I have to get a custody for my children. Because I want them with me always. Listen to me. I will be with you. I will hold your hand through the process. Okay? You will go through it alone. I'll be there. Uh, doesn't this in some way tell you that we're meant to be together? This is happening too fast. Don't rush. One step at a time. One step at a time. Don't rush. Okay? I'm not going to tell you to do what you do want to do. If you don't want to leave the marriage, that's okay. If you want to leave the marriage, that's also fine. Whatever your decision is, I'll support you. Okay? I'm going to support you. No one should ever treat you bad. Let me look at you. Auntie Liz. Yes, baby. Mommy said we'll be moving out of this house. Will you be coming with us? Do you want me to come with you? Yeah, sure I do. And besides, you shouldn't even ask. Then the answer is yes. I will be coming with you. I like that. Yes, baby. But Aunt Liz, mm -hmm. why do we have to move out of this place? I like it here. It's cool. What do you think? But I think mommy has a very good reason. I wish dad could come with us. Because mommy said he's not. Oh. Did your teacher mark the homework she gave you yesterday? Yes, she did. Okay. But why isn't Daddy coming with us? Is there any problem? Clara, I have no idea. I don't want to be separated from Dad. I don't like that. But Auntie Liz, please. Promise you will beg Dad to come with us. That will make me happy. Please. Clara, I do not have that power. I don't. 
Why? But Daddy will listen to you. Huh? <laughs> you think so? Yeah. But Daddy will listen to your mommy better. So why don't you try to talk to mommy so she can beg Daddy to come with us? I've tried countless times, but she won't even let me finish. It's okay, my darling. Hmm? Don't worry. I'm going to talk to mommy. In fact, don't worry. There's always a way. We're going to like find a way to fix everything, okay? I promise you, you'll be fine. Cheer up. Huh? That's okay. So just continue with your program while I take Ella to bed. Ella, I'd like to sleep. We've not even started watching this movie. I'm sleep on. Here are the divorce papers. What? Samura! Someone had to get them. You and I can both agree that this marriage has lost all chances of survival. And you were right. I'm not sorry. I love Oyi and I don't intend to stop seeing him anytime soon. So please, don't make this thing any more difficult than it already is. Sign the papers and let's end this. You're gonna love it here. Look, we have a new space today. Look at that dining. Do you like it? Look. <laughs> you gonna give me fun? Okay. Big, what do you think? Love it. The finishing is good, really yeah, good. Don't you just love the woodwork? Yes. yes, yes. Ooh. Girls, don't worry. I have something that will brighten your day. Wait till you see your room. Yes, your rooms. Your favorite colors. Paintings. Let's go. Come with me. Come, come, come. Let me show you. I don't like this house, like seriously. Why not, baby? I think it's really beautiful here. I prefer our old house. That's better. I know, right? And who's that man that came with us the other day and always sleeping with mom in her bedroom? I thought your mommy already did an introduction. I probably wasn't listening because I don't even like that man. One bit. Listen to me, Clara. We can't change anything now. You just have to try and manage the situation. Okay? <sighs> I miss Dad already. Don't worry. We will go and see Daddy very soon. Tomorrow? No, we can't do that tomorrow. <sighs> but don't worry, very soon, okay? Auntie Liz. Yes, baby. Do you tell mommy to throw that man out of this house? What? No! 
That man is your new daddy. Never! He can't be my dad. Never. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> Listen to me, Clara. I know it's difficult, but you're still too young to understand these things. Now promise me that you're going to respect your mommy and her new husband. Go on. Fine, but I don't like that. You don't have a choice, baby. You don't. I miss daddy too! <laughs> come here, baby. How are you? So you've been up by your house too. Mom, for goodness sake, why is that man taking daddy's place? Do not address him as that man. I've told you that's your new dad. But he's not dad and I don't like him. Be quiet! Why did you become so disrespectful, Clara? Huh? Mom, let's just go back home to daddy. I said keep quiet. Look, I love you and your sister very much. And I want us to be a big family. And I just want you to give Oye a chance and love him. And you'll find out that he's a really sweet man. I miss dad so much. And we were a very big happy family before, mom. Come here, baby. Come. <sighs> Look, I understand you miss your dad, okay? But you have mommy here and Oye, who's willing to be a dad figure to you. And when when you get to know him, that if you give him a chance, you would you might even grow to love him more. My love. I know you might be too young to understand things, but just trust what mommy is doing. Trust mommy, okay? Okay. We're going to be so happy. Ray, please stop doing this to yourself. Please. Why should I stop? I'm a loser. Just leave me alone. See, you can't punish yourself for all this. Sanura made that choice and it's not your fault. You need to get hold of yourself. I love her. I love her so much. I've been a good father and a husband. But why did she choose to do this to me? Why? Ray. I perfectly understand how you're feeling. I understand very well, but it's something you need to understand. You can't make people's choice for them. She made her choice. People are selfish. They only do what is good for them and for them alone. And you can't keep living like this. You need to get strong for your kids. You need to put yourself together. I'm trying to, but I don't even know how to try. It's like my bones have been broken into pieces. You can try harder. I believe in you. You can get through this. Why don't you start from you giving me this alcohol first? That's better. You don't put yourself under this because of somebody who has already chosen what to do with her life. No more alcohol, please. Anyways, I brought you some food. I'll go and serve it. Stay away from alcohol. Meanwhile, I'm taking it. Please put yourself together. Don't let your kids see you this way. It doesn't make sense. I thought you needed this. What's up, my love? What? <coughs> oh, thanks, man. Mm. You're almost done. Okay, so. Then I'm done. Good. Can I have a laptop now? Thank you very much. Okay. 
good. Why are you so sweet? <laughs> I don't have a choice, do I? Can't believe this is the marriage that I've been missing. How do you mean? Ray never used to do this for me. He barely had time for me. <laughs> you can't blame the guy. He doesn't know how to treat a queen. <laughs> I hope I finish that so you can rest. Thank you. For nothing. And you know how to treat a queen. I try. <laughs> Thank you, my love. You're welcome. It's so sweet. Come here. Mm. <laughs> I love you. I love you too much. There's something strange about Mr. Ui. Even though I can't really tell what it is. I mean... The sneaky calls, the attitude, everything is just suspicious. And then the kids don't even like him. And that is strange as well, because Clara and Ella are the sweetest kids. Or is it that I'm just overthinking things? Or maybe I'm just misjudging him, probably because the kids don't like him. <laughs> Anyways... I'll just let things be and focus on my work. What do I even know? What was I even doing, Seth? It's funny, right? Yes. <laughs> Hi, angels. How are you guys doing? Fine. So, how may we help you? Um, it's nothing. I was on my way from work and I decided to get you guys some goodies. Sorry, but our dad taught us not to accept goodies from strangers. Oh, I'm not a stranger. Yes, you are. You are to us. So, you're not going to take these goodies? They're really nice. You would like them. Ella, hold on. If we accept this from you, does it mean we start calling you dad? Oh, no, no. Not, not at all. Better. Then you can keep it in our room and leave. I don't even get it, thank you. You can take your goodies back if you want. You can take it. I'm not forcing you. I'll, I'll take them to your room. How was your day? It was good. I should have just started telling you about it because I tried to get close to the kids. Really? Mm hmm. Tell me more. <laughs> How'd they, I go? They rejected me the whole time. <laughs> really? It looks like this is going to take some adjusting to, you know? <sighs> Clara is just so stubborn. Hmm. I think I'm still having a hard time adjusting to the fact that she's growing too fast. Mm -hmm. Well, let's hope that she comes around real quick because she might be the one to throw me out of this house. Come on. <laughs> Plus, she's not the only one that doesn't want me here. There's some other people that don't want me here. Wait, Liz? Yeah. Come on. Liz doesn't have a problem. Liz hates my guts. 
And I speak like that since day one. Please. Yes. Huh. <laughs> she don't want me here. Oh, babe. Hmm? Just give it some more time. A little more time. When they find out how so much of a sweet person you are, they would accept you. You sure? 100%. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you, baby. And oh. we had dinner. My dinner is right here. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, my God. I was just thinking about you the whole time at work. <laughs> babe, you need to calm down. I'm telling you to calm down. Really I'm tired down. of waiting already. Babe, this is money we are talking about. Huh? What exactly is delaying the money? <laughs> you think this is just cough up money? Can you cough up that kind of money for us? I'm tired of waiting already. Babe. I just miss you so much. I can't wait for us to be together. I know, I miss you too. Patience is the order of the day. Oh, that's the name of the game, patience. I just miss you so much, babe. I'm tired of waiting. Do you think I want to be with her? <laughs> of course not. It's you. Hmm? Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. Come here. Hmm? I miss you. Hmm? Can't wait. Yeah, I know. But then we got to leave here now before Josh comes back. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you what's Bye. coming here. Yeah. And it's better we don't even live here together. You get. <laughs> you gotta be safe. Yeah. That's why I like you. You understand the game. <laughs> Sleeping Beauty. Wake up. Breakfast in bed. <laughs> Come on, Ew. chop, 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 chop. Sit up. Oh. I made you breakfast. I have to admit, I have the most romantic husband in the world. You're so sweet. And I'm so lucky. <laughs> Yum. You like mm. it? This is delicious. Are you kidding? I told you it was good. Baby, I've been thinking. Um, I think I need to go into real estate. Real estate? Yeah, I think it's a, I think it's a good business to do. What happened to your initial plan? You, you know, you just gave me half of the money and... Yeah. You really tried, I, and I didn't want to come and start troubling you again for the rest of it, you know what I mean? Mm. So I just said, you know what, let me do real estate instead and just keep it moving, you know? Babe, look, I don't want you to give up on your dreams and your career, okay? Not because of money. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry that I haven't been able to come up with the balance. Oh. It's just, I incurred a whole lot of expenses after the divorce. Yeah. You know, having to get this apartment, mm -hmm. changing the children's school, yeah. and our private wedding. Yeah, yeah. I wish that, you know, yeah, if there was a way we could. Okay. It's okay. I mean, 
This is the reason why I didn't want to come to you. You have done too much and I appreciate it. So look, I, 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 I just think, let me do real estate and just you know, forget about no. this dream. No, that doesn't mean you should give up on your dream. How much are we talking about here? Uh, it's about 8.3 million. Yeah, thereabouts. But I mean, if we want to approximate, we can just say 9 million or something. Okay. Let's see what I can do in a few weeks. Yes, I'm expecting something. So I, I think we should be able to do that in a few weeks. Really? Yes. Are you sure it's no stress again to you? Oh yeah, it's no stress. You've suffered a lot in your life. So now that we're together, come here, baby. Don't let your food fall. No. <laughs> Babe, mm -hmm. now that we're together, mm -hmm. I'm going to try my best to ease all that stress away. Your life is going to be beautiful. How did I get so lucky? <laughs> no, how did I get so lucky? Now finish your food. Okay, Teddy. Join me now. Yeah. Watching you eat will make me full. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, 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 I heard you the first time. What I want to know is what's going on. You think I don't know it's been three months already? I just need to know what's happening. Like, fill me in. Don't keep me in the dark. Just give me feedback. Give me feedback. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, we'll talk later. Don't keep me in the dark. Bye. What's happening? Is anything the problem? You've been packing your luggages. Are you traveling? What kind of stupid question is that from your stupid mouth? Whatever I do, is your business. hear me? Ma, I don't mean to pry, but is Mr. Oye traveling? Because he just left the house with all his belongings. And I can't help but feel something is wrong. Yes. Just now. Just now. Eh. O okay, ma. Okay, ma. No problem. All right. Sanora, I'll be far gone by the time you read this. I know this will come as a shock and I'm deeply sorry. Honestly, the love I had for you vanished the moment I noticed you were married with kids. And now when I look back, the only thing that kept me chasing after you 
was because I, I was tired of being a loser and I wanted to gain something from you. I wish things could have been different, but I felt like I had no choice. I hope you can find it to your heart to forgive me one day. Please know that I still care for you deeply, even though I can't be with you anymore. Thank you for the money. Oui. That's now. Josh! Jasmine! Josh! What? Relax now. Where is Uyi Abi? Where is he? He has traveled. What do you mean by Uyi has traveled? I need to tell you about it. Tell me what? Where is Uyi, please? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm being serious. He came here about two days ago. He said he was traveling. He even said he know about it. <laughs> you're joking. Oh, like joking. No or what? Like that. Uh, Why you wouldn't travel without me? So you are telling me you don't know? I don't know anything! What do you mean you can't travel without? You guys broke up now, so what? That's why we made it look like, but no, we didn't break up. We planned all this together. We've been working together. Okay, see. Me, I don't know anything about that. All I know is that I traveled two days ago. And he said you know about it. I don't know nothing! Why you wouldn't travel without me? Okay, fine. I think... I think he left a letter for yourself. What letter? What are you talking about? Like, I don't understand. So You're joking wrong. with me. I'm, I'm not getting this joke. Why would I joke? What, what letter? <sighs> What's the, what letter is this? Relax, breathe. How can you do this to me? I didn't deserve this. I really want to be a little bit more. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. It's not going to be over. Just relax. Breathe. Oh my God. Just, just relax. Oh my God. Yeah, hello? I'm on my way already. Say about an hour. Yes, yes. Okay. Samura, what are you doing here? Right. What happened? Are the kids all right? Yes, the kids are fine. I'm here to beg for your forgiveness. I'm so sorry for wrecking our marriage. I thought he loved me. I thought he loved me. 
Let me guess. He dumped you. Wait. He collected your money and disappeared. I knew it. I knew that guy was up to no good. But you couldn't listen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for wrecking her marriage. I thought we had a chance together. As we planned. As we had always planned over the years. But I was wrong. He... He used me for what he wanted. And then left. I was so stupid. Please forgive me. You don't deserve a woman like me. All you ever did was love me. Support me. But I threw all that in the mud. You didn't, you didn't deserve that. Wait, please find a place in your heart to forgive me. I'm sorry. Samira, <laughs> you brought this upon yourself. And now you have to face the consequences of your actions. Yes, you broke my heart. But I have moved on. It wasn't easy for me. But I'm okay now. <laughs> Read my lips. I will never accept you back again. It saddens my heart that you are the mother of my kids. And looking at you makes me sick. Just leave. No, please. Samira, leave my house. Please. Please. I said get out! Get out. Out! Get out. Why can't I?